Our first order of business is to determine who gets into the hot seat for the chance at the $1 million. We'll do that by seeing who can correctly arrange your group of items the quickest in our fastest finger round. Here's how it works. First we'll show you a question. Then we'll show you four items. To arrange them in the correct order, press the corresponding symbols on your game controller. If you change your mind, press the L1 button to erase the previous entry. Once you're satisfied with your answer, press the R1 button to lock it in. The fastest player to lock in the correct sequence will be our first person in the hot seat. Okay, here's how it works. You're going to be asked a question and then you'll be given four possible answers to choose from. Press the symbol of your selection on the game controller to lock in your answer. If you're correct, you'll win the dollar value of that question and advance to the next level. You have three lifelines to help you along the way. You can use these at any time by hitting your R1 button. If you choose the 50-50 lifeline, the computer will eliminate two of your choices, leaving the correct answer and one incorrect answer. Another lifeline you can use is phone a friend. Call up one of my friends to hear his or her opinion on the question. I I'm gonna have to guess A, cause that one looks best. Finally, you can ask the audience. We conducted a random poll and asked for opinions on each question. If you use the Ask the Audience lifeline, we'll show you the results of that poll. If you have used all three of your lifelines and are unsure of the answer, you can choose to stop and walk away. If you walk, you'll keep the money you've won up to that point. The only thing I didn't mention yet is this. Miss one question on your way to the million dollar prize, and that's it, you're through, game over. You're out of here. Who wants to be a millionaire? Third edition. Who wants to be a millionaire? Third edition. Congratulations, you're a pretend millionaire. What did you expect? It's just a video game. How many times do I have to tell you? It's not like you really get the racing trophy at the end of that racing video game. I mean, did you really get to be ruler of the universe when you defeated all those ninja warriors? I don't think so. Why would this game be any different? It's not! It's a game! Come on! Until next time. Nice going! Fifteen questions in a row without even breaking a sweat. I'm really impressed. Why, I almost feel bad we don't have any real money to give you. Think of it this way. At least my congratulations are tax-free! See you next time. Hey, great job, 15 questions in a row on a wide range of topics. You should be very proud. I'm proud of you. Of course, that check you just saw, fake. You know that, don't you? Don't bother printing it out. The bank's not gonna take it. In fact, they might try to lock you up. But you've been warned. Remember, be good. Hey, you're a millionaire. Just don't forget that money isn't everything. In fact, in this game, it isn't anything. That check you just saw, you know, for a virtual million dollars? Just a polite way of saying it's worth nothing. Nothing. See you next time. Well, now you're a millionaire. Time for all those distant relatives and old friends to call you up and ask for a handout. And they will. 
Lucky for you, there isn't any real cash here. Yeah, so they're not going to get a thing. Nothing. A lot easier being rich when it's all virtual money, isn't it? But still you wish? Ah, forget about it. I'll see you later. Okay, let's play.